It's only been like a few months since Apple unveiled the iPhone 15 series at its Wonderlust event in California. However, there have been a lot of rumors about the next flagships from Apple. The iPhone 16 series, like other iPhone models before it, is expected to debut in September this year. Past reports have revealed that Apple is unlikely to make any major change to the design of the iPhone 16 series this year, except for a new dedicated camera button and slightly bigger displays on both Pro models. This means the iPhone will be carrying almost the same back design for about five generations now. While this isn't necessarily a bad thing, I personally think it's high time we see something new especially from the back, since there isn't much else they can actually do with the front for now, until under-panel sensors become industry standard, and that's going to take a while. Anyway, you may be wondering what the selling point for this year's iPhones would be. Well, the company has done something it rarely does, and that's talk about what it's working on for the future. AI is the next big phase of smartphone technological development, and we've already started seeing companies like Google and Samsung incorporate AI in practical ways on the Pixel 8 and Galaxy S24 series. Apple seems to be curiously missing from this race so far, but during a recent investor call, the company confirmed that it does not intend to stay behind with the iPhone this year. During Apple's quarterly earnings call yesterday, Tim Cook confirmed that the company is working on generative AI features. Apple will be talking more about these generative AI features later this year, seemingly alongside the release of iOS 18. Here's a quote of exactly what he said. You can pause the video and read it for yourself if you like. But in summary, Cook did not offer exact details on the company's use of AI not even disclosing which devices or platforms it will come to. However, we've seen from rumors and leaks over the past few weeks what shape it could take. Some code uncovered in iOS 17.4 suggests Siri will be able to use AI for summarization, smart reply suggestions and messages, and use AI across apps like Apple Music, Pages, and Keynote. Apple is also testing different AI models, some running on device and some relying on the internet. As to when we can expect iOS 18, WWDC 2024 would be a good bet. We expect the event to be held sometime in early June, where Apple will detail some of the foundational work of incorporating AI into iOS and other Apple platforms. With that said, do consider subscribing to our channel to stay updated with all the latest news regarding the iPhone 16 series. Also, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and turn on post notification, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.